Those are great. And specifically the Sunset Highway flyover that we were noticing the big backup. I bet Sun Glare has something to do with that because it is a bright start to the day, a glorious start to our Friday and almost weekend. You can see the sun is shining in Portland and at the Skamania Lodge and out along the coast. Clouds are starting to increase. There's a weak disturbance just offshore that will increase clouds west of the Cascades as we move into the afternoon. So your hour by hour planner, great morning to get outside, get your exercise in. Noontime, if you're going to be in downtown Portland celebrating the beeves at Pioneer Courthouse Square, temperatures will be right around 70 degrees. Partly cloudy to still mostly sunny conditions. And then later on this evening, 5 o'clock, I think we go partly sunny to mostly cloudy by then with temperatures in the mid 70s. All in all, a pretty nice Friday on tap. Let's take it hour by hour. 9 o'clock this morning, there are those clouds just offshore. There are some sprinkles out there too. I think mostly north of Portland is where we'll see a few isolated sprinkles this afternoon. That's 4 o'clock. You'll notice those clouds have spread into the Willamette Valley. Fewer in the way of clouds as you head south down I-5 east of the Cascades, probably to mostly sunny all day long. Now Saturday, wake it up at 8 o'clock in the morning. We'll have concrete gray skies west of the Cascades. That marine layer moves on in. There'll be clouds will be banked up against the mountains east of the mountains. Lots of sunshine tomorrow and we break into some sunshine west of the Cascades too. There's 2:30 in the afternoon, so a nice evening on Saturday and then Sunday morning. A disturbance moves through, bringing potentially a few spotty sprinkles early on, but the clouds clear out and the sun comes out in the afternoon on Sunday. So a nice weekend, really pretty uneventful, but don't be shocked if you feel a sprinkle, especially Saturday night into Sunday morning. Temperature trend by and large temperatures below average until we hit the 4th of July, 4th of July next Wednesday. That's the opening day of Blues Fest, and I believe the St. Paul Rodeo opens the day before uh, the 4th of July. So uh, really beautiful weather for both events. 82 degrees on Thursday. Your official forecast calls for lots of sunshine on the 4th, maybe a few brief morning clouds, but warm conditions in the afternoon. Not too hot, not too cool. Today out along the coast, increasing clouds, light showers, especially uh, north of Tillamook. I-5 corridor temperatures in the mid 70s this afternoon with a sunny start and clouds in the afternoon. East of the mountains, mostly sunny skies, topping out 80 degrees in Madras, upper 70s for Bend. Sunny this morning over government camp and then some clouds roll on in the second half of the day. Clouds also increase through the gorge with westerly winds gusting up to about 25 miles per hour. Here's your seven day forecast now. Temperatures in the 70s through the weekend and then we're really going to turn the heat up I think as we head into the latter part of next week. Back to you guys.